It's Monday morning, and this is our wig session. I've got Jay, Drew, and Ashley here to uh, go over a wig for this week. Hi, guys. Hello. Hi. So, um, just some numbers to throw out there to start out with. Uh, our current MPS is at a 26. We got a promoter this morning. Um, still leaves our year-to-date MPS in the mid-20s right now. Um, our lead measures, lead measure one, by the way. What's our first lead measure for wig, Jay? Uh, first lead measure is... Customers coming in, we can ask whatever they have, whatever they come in here, we can help them with, no matter what they come in for. Great, positive can-do attitude. Drew, what's exactly. the measure number two? The uh, P10 experience. And what's the, that? Uh, making sure that whenever the customer goes to leave, you go and make, you give them a business card with purpose, so you can build a referral pro, uh, referrals out of their friends, you give them a card, card for their friends, uh, so it helps build up your funnel, and then it also lets you know if there's anything else that you can help them with, make sure they're leaving happy and that everything's satisfied. Good. So right now, our positive can-do attitude is in the mid-90s. Our business card with a purpose is it's shy of 50 this week. Mm -hmm. um, Ash, you're a wig champion. What uh, what do you think is leading to our, our lead measure two being so low? Um, not knowing how to ask for, at, refer like a business cards with every transaction. Still kind of picking and choosing what transactions we feel like we can give a card for and what transactions we can't. So Jay, what are we going to do to make sure that we get that number up? Because obviously it's important. I mean, we're, we, we want to be in the, in the mid eighties and we, mm -hmm. and we should have been there by now, honestly. Um, we've, we've had plenty of time to get up there. Um, you being our new guy, uh, a little bit more of an outside perspective. Um, what are we going to do to make sure that that second uh, lead measure gets pushed, pushed up quickly? Um, I I think we just need to stop like what she's saying, just pick and choosing the customers and just every single customer, no matter if it's a bill pay or anything, you know, just refer them, make sure that they have any friends and want to come in, just give them your business card for every customer instead of picking and choosing. Okay. Uh, Drew, I said that uh, our year to date MPS was in the mid twenties. Um, how are we going to get that closer to our goal of 40 by the end of the year? Um, well, we definitely need to make sure that we're continuing to do all of our five EBs. Um, making sure that we're giving all of our customers the perfect 10 experience so they're leaving satisfied that way and that way we make sure we're capturing the email and that way they are actually receiving our surveys um, we want to make sure to instill that 10 experience in their heads so if they get a survey they think 10 not that we tell them to do a survey or anything but just make sure that they know have that number in their head and they um, will actually go online and do it because so we don't keep getting all the bad people the bad customers that are upset still that are only ones doing the service. So Ash, on that point, and the last question I have then, so, I mean, typically customers fill out surveys when they got something they wanna say, mm -hmm. uh, and typically in a negative light, how do we get customers that get that good experience from us to to fill out the surveys? I mean, what do, what do we have to make sure that we do um, as reps so that uh, they can't help but fill out a survey for us? Um, just kind of go above and beyond. Even for people that come in that aren't upset, I know you know, you know if someone's mad, we try to do whatever we can to resolve it. Treat the people that aren't mad just as, just as important. Like just try to make sure we go above and beyond and leave that positive experience in the head. Make it memorable. Like it's memorable is the most likely way to do it. Perfect. Make it memorable. All right, guys. Thanks for uh, our wig session this week. Uh, hopefully, we'll see some change quickly. Thanks. Okay.